A woman who is completely blind is among the nearly 9,000 runners gearing up for this weekend's gorgeous run for the health of it. Alex Jokic joining us now live from the half marathon start line in Kalamazoo. Alex, with the important message she wants to share tonight. Yeah, that's right, Kate. Jessica Hodges tells me the hardest part of her training, strangely enough, wasn't the running, it was finding a guide. She had to search for one for more than three months. Now she hopes her story will help change that for others. A half marathon is no easy feat, but imagine running those 13.1 miles like this. That's what it'll look like for Jessica Hodges. I'm completely blind. The grad student has two prosthetic eyes and is deaf in one ear. She's always wanted to race, so... I purchased a treadmill in January and started running and hoped that I would find guides in time. But she ran into obstacles right off the bat. Quite a big disconnect. People don't know how to find each other. Basically, all I'm doing is steering her with my hand. Okay. Thanks to a stroke of luck on Facebook, Jessica found Joe. I, I do a lot of trail running, so I'm actually pretty used to staring around and looking down and checking out where my feet are going anyway. So. Now she hopes to change the course of racing for other blind runners, just like Joe did for her. Raising awareness with every step. That other visually impaired athletes want to run, they just need someone to run with. We would not sue any of our guides if I stepped, like, stepped in a pothole or like ran into a tree. Like that, you know, that, that, several, that sense of mutual respect and understanding and trust is there. And my guides haven't quit on me yet, so I think they're okay. <laughs> Taking this challenge in stride, the pair will cross the finish line that way too. Now, if you're a runner or even a walker interested in becoming a guide for a visually impaired athlete, we've posted everything you need to know online at WWMT.com. And, of course, to all the runners participating in this weekend's gorgeous run, best of luck. Live in Kalamazoo, Alex Jokic, News Channel 3.